What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Danielle. Subscribe down below. I post new videos every Wednesday and Sunday. Today I'm going to be talking to you guys about things I'm loving right now. This is one of my favorite videos to film, you guys know. I love just talking about things. I didn't do one last month because of all the craziness of moving into my new apartment and coming back to school. So I have a list of things from like last month and this month. And so there's just a lot of things I want to talk to you guys about, which I think is really fun. Um, I'm in my living room right now. Finally finished our gallery wall. There's Drake right there. Love him. Let's get it. This video is sponsored by Thread Up. I absolutely love Thread Up. You guys know I'm really into shopping. I have a problem. I like finding new fun clothes to wear for different events. And right now I am currently trying to find stuff for game days because our colors are red and black and white. So I want to find cool game day outfits. I'm going to Music Midtown really soon. So I'm like music festival vibes. I just, I want some cute fun pieces. Um, cause it's still pretty warm out here in Athens. So I just, I don't know. So Thread Up is the world's largest thrift store online. And they have your favorite brands for up to 90% off. I just got a couple items off of Thread Up. I got some stuff from Topshop, Blank, NYC, Free People. I'll be showing you guys in a second, but seriously, for such markdown prices and the items are so nice and they carefully like are curating and looking at all these items to make sure they're good because I love thrifting. I'm like all about like reusing things. However, I walk in a thrift store and I get so stressed. So that's why I like Thread Up. Thread Up is actually offering my viewers 30% off your first order. And if you just click the link down below, it'll get you 30% off your first order. I had so much fun shopping on Thread Up. I literally got my items so fast too, which I was kind of worried about. And I ordered everything and I got everything in like, I don't know, four or five days. It was really fast. Um, and it's very customizable on the website and they also have an app so you can literally just be like, oh, like looking for free people things or Topshop or Madewell, literally any brand you want, they've got it, which I just, I love. They want it, we got it, whatever that word is. So needless to say, ThreadUp is one of my current favorites and I've been telling my friends about them because my friends are always looking for inexpensive places to shop to for like name brand stuff. So they're like already hype about it. I'm just gonna show you guys a couple items I got just because I have to. I got a pair of free people shorts. I don't even know, like free people is so darn expensive and the fact that I got these on Thread Up is just so hype. And I got three different shirt options for game days. So I got this bodysuit from Topshop that I love. It is so cute. I love the print. Um, it's just like a really cool design. And I think this is going to be great even for Music Midtown or Music Festival I'm going to or something like that. This Topshop bodysuit retails for $60 and I got it for $15.99. And then I also got a similar um, bodysuit to the black one also from Topshop and it's this white one. I love this. I love the cutouts. I love the mesh. Like this is sick. Like I'm obsessed and like they probably don't even sell it at Topshop anymore. This Topshop bodysuit retails for $60 and I got it for $13.99. Last shirt I got is this black cool. I don't remember what brand. Oh, it's Topshop also. <laughs> I clearly clicked the top shot filter, um, but I loved this black top. This is perfect for going out at night, also for game days with like some funky pants. This top shop tank retails for $45 and I got it for $16.99. I got these shorts. They are so cute, free people. They are a size small, I believe, yes. And they're just like a bright red color. I thought these were super fun. I like how they're not super short. These free people shorts retail for $58 and I got them for $17.99. I'm really into denim right now. Guys, this is going to be my new favorite skirt ever. It's from the brand Blank NYC. I've always wanted to try their stuff, but it's always been kind of pricey. So, but found it on thread up. Look at this skirt. It's like, a, it, it's not your average denim skirt, you know? I love how it flares out on the bottom. It's just so darn cute. It's like a little ruffly. It is so flattering on. It fits so well. And it's like, oh, it's stretchy. Love that for me. This Blank NYC skirt retails for $54. I got it for $15.99. And lastly, I got a pair of the Topshop Moto jeans because I love them. Um, so they're just these light wash ones with some distressness. I think these are more of a straight leg situation if I remember right. These Topshop jeans retail for $45. I got them for $16.99. And everything comes in this really happy um, polka dot packaging. And like I knew when I went to the mailroom which ones were thread up because like the packaging is just so cute and like it stands out. I'm just... I'm here for it. I have a ton of other goodies in here that I want to show you guys. I feel so professional, like my basket of goodies that I want to talk about. First up are these puppies. These are the Naturally Serious Get Even Cold Pressed Peel Pads. I'm into any sort of cold pressed pad right now. I don't know what it is about them. So I got these when I went um, to Mexico and they gave us a ton of products. This was one of the products that they gave us and I used it every morning. It's so refreshing. Basically, they're these little circular pads. These are, these are very, very nice. They're not super strong or anything. They smell so good. They smell 
honestly kind of like cucumbers and it just smells like a spa and so when i wake up in the morning i take one of these pads and i just wipe it over my face kind of massage my face a little bit honestly and it truly wakes me up it puts me in the best mood it smells good these are almost out i'm probably going to repurchase them because they're just that good and i love them i never heard of this brand before i'll have a link down below to everything i'm talking about by the way if that doesn't go without saying next up is this straw right here so i have converted to bamboo straws um i'm drinking iced coffee right now look at me reusable cup are we proud also when i was in mexico i just had a lot of things happen to me in mexico um they were when we ordered iced coffee they'd give it to us with a bamboo straw and there was just something so different i've got metal straws i use them sometimes but I think I like bamboo straws better. I got like a 10 pack on Amazon. I'll link the one down below that I got personally. Um, and it came with like this size, which is a thicker size that I kind of like better. And then there's like the thinner slide size. It came in like a multi-pack, so it's awesome. Also, I'm standing on my tippy toes right now and I don't know why. Like, I feel like I could easily just do that and like then that fixes the problem yeah i'm also a really slow drinker my friends make fun of me like i just sip things very 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 slowly i'm always like my coffee lasts for like hours which i guess isn't a bad thing but sometimes you know i need my coffee to get in my bloodstream faster in the morning when i wake up i like to have a hot cup of coffee while i'm getting ready and usually i only have like 30 minutes to get ready i i, I try to give myself time in the mornings but sometimes if i'm in a rush you know anyways i drink my hot coffee with the bamboo straws too and i'm able to drink it before i'm out of the door and i'm caffeinated before i'm out of the door it's just amazing i don't know why it's just a very pleasing thing a lot of people think when i post these on my stories that these were cookie straws no if i bit on this it just simply would not taste good next up big black sunglasses i'm here for it i i've probably talked about these before i just when especially when i go to spin because i live near spin studio now um i like don't have a makeup on i just want to put on some big sunglasses to just mask it all because i don't like to wear makeup to work out and i don't know i just feel cool i feel like a baddie so these are the sunglasses i've been wearing a lot and you guys always ask where they're from so i thought i'd mention them again in a video these are from celine i'll try to find these exact ones and i'll link them down below um i got them a couple years ago but they are just awesome i love them they're big they're obnoxious a little bit expensive so you could fridge why now why now thank you you could easily find really inexpensive ones then i just recently got these from the brand Privé revu revo i've been looking at these styles online and i think they're so cool like obviously they're not for everyone but come on i feel like i feel like a kardashian i don't know i just think these are really cool i've been loving them i haven't had them for long so don't hurt me but i had to include them in the video because i think they're really cool i think these are a little bit more inexpensive i don't really know but i just i want to like keep these on for the rest of the video because they're like Next up, we've got this guy. This is a slip. I think that's the brand um, scrunchie. Ooh, ah, uh, it's like a silky scrunchie. I don't really use it like like what to wear out, but when I get home, I don't know what it is. But like after I've done my hair and I like go out, I'll come back. I don't want to like mess up my hair, but I just want it out of my face. Maybe I want to take my makeup off or I'm like cooking or something. I just want my hair out of my face, but I don't want to like mess up my hair. I use this because you can easily just like put your hair back and it doesn't put a crease in your hair, which is the biggest thing for me. I'll use these at night when I'm like washing my face or whatever it may be. I just love these and they're really soft and they don't tug at your hair and I just thought I'd include them because I think they're awesome. Look how cute my AirPods are. Okay, big AirPods girl. I'm one of those, I don't care, like whatever. They make my life a lot easier when I'm walking to class, whatever, I'm not here to sell you on AirPods. You can get those at your own disposal, but Whenever I go to grab my AirPods out of like my front pocket and my backpack, I like can't find them and then I have this like mini heart attack of like, oh my god, did I lose them? Like, I don't know what it is. Because they're white, like the case is white, I just can never find them. So on Amazon, I found this like silicone yellow AirPods case and it really has changed my life. It like doesn't, it, it's nice because it doesn't slide around a lot. So if I put it on a table, I know they'll stay right there. I don't know. I don't know fam. I really love it and it has a hole so you can charge your AirPods with these on I just get so happy when I grab this out of my backpack to walk to class in the morning So it's the little things in life, you know, I just thought I'd recommend these because I Just think this is so cute Next up is skincare matcha. Um, this is the Ojai pumped up hydration skin quench spray serum in the scent in the whatever energizing matcha so this is just like a spray serum which i was really interested by so i got this at urban outfitters um i think i included this in the haul a while back i love it it's basically like like a face mist but it's like more of a serum so it's a little bit thicker um but i'll like spray it on over makeup i don't care 
It smells so good. It smells like matcha. I swear it just really does energize my face. Like I'll spray it. So what I'll do in the morning is I'll use those cold pressed pads that I showed you guys and then I'll spray this on right after and then put vitamin C serum on and it's just like an amazing concoction and my skin just looks so hydrated and happy and I feel good. On the other side of the spectrum of skincare, I have been breaking out. I think it started with sorority recruitment, waking up early, going to bed late, wearing makeup for like 12 hours on end. My skin took a toll and then stress with back to school. Like it was just a lot. Like I've got like a couple chin pimples right here like we're just really killing the game right now anyways I finally caved and like tried out this Mario Badescu drying lotion that like literally everyone and their mother has I just like I was always one of those people like oh like spot treatment never works like it never works and it never fully takes away a pimple I realize you just have to honestly let it ride out however this stuff really helps so at night what I'll do is I'll just take a q-tip dip a little bit in this drying lotion pop it on it has to be like a I want to say juicy pimple but it has to be like you know you know the type of pimples it'll work on when you want like the pimple to kind of dry out and kind of flatten that's when I use this so like I used this last night on these right here and they flattened out and they're a little bit drier and it's easier to put makeup on and it's just my skin looks a little bit more smooth and even and they really do work I put like a hefty amount like I definitely like pack it on but just, that's just me but yeah you can get these at literally like Urban Outfitters I think that's where I got this and it really does work Oh my gosh, guys, this stuff is so good. I literally am obsessed with this stuff. Like, I don't even know what to say. This is the LMS Pro Collagen Cleansing Balm. I never in my life thought I would be in front of a camera telling you guys to try a cleansing balm. I don't know why, but I just feel like I never would. When I take off my makeup at night, I use makeup wipes. I can't get away from makeup wipes. I just love them. It's just very satisfying to just wipe away my day. <laughs> However, after that, I feel like my makeup's not completely off. So that's when I use this. I got this on an influencer trip, and they gave this to us. And it smells so good. And Elemis is like a really nice brand. So I was like, okay, I'll try it. So basically what I do, it's literally like a bomb. And you take it and I just, after I take off all my makeup, or you're supposed to use it to take off your makeup. I just like to use wipes first. So you don't even have to use wipes if you don't want. Um, and you just literally, I'll just like rub it, lather it onto my face. And it feels so good. It's so moisturizing. It smells so good. Your skin looks so glowy. And then I'll wash it off with water. And my skin just feels so happy and good inside. Like sometimes I'll even use it if I didn't have makeup on just to kind of refresh my face. This stuff is awesome. I mean, it says it's pro collagen cleansing balm. It just, it's really great, but it's meant to like dissolve your makeup and just cleanse your skin. So. Sneakers, baby. I walk to all my classes. Athens is a very hilly town, um, AKA like I'm walking like up and down hills to get, none of my classes are close together. Like I have one class in one building and then I have a class in a building pretty, like, I mean, it's walking distance, but it's like not a fun walk. And then I have to go back and then back. Like they're not, Back to back. I don't know why that happened to me, but anyways, I do a lot of walking and I like to be kind of fashionable, but sometimes you just need to get some good old A6 sneakers. So I got these recently off of Nordstrom um, and I like them because they're a little bit more stylish and fun. They're like running sneakers and they're like actually like a rose gold situation with like nude and white but um and i like the black laces though i got a lot of questions i literally posted like a very low-key instagram story with like my feet and everyone's like where'd you get these where'd you get these so these are asics off of nordstrom maybe they're especially for nordstrom i'm not sure we'll have them linked down below but i love these babies they're awesome and they're so comfortable and i'm not like miserable walking to class it's great all right so those are all the tangible items now i want to talk to you guys about tv shows and music TV shows, I've got a list of them. I'm, I, I like to watch different shows when I'm in different moods. So I've got like a couple that I'm watching right now at the same time. And it's really not that hard to keep track of. But these are the ones I'm loving right now. Euphoria. Oh my gosh. I think I talked about it before in a vlog. I don't really know. Margot and I started it together when we were living in New York just for a little bit. Just to like start it and see if we liked it. And we both really liked it. I don't know. I feel like that show it talks about a lot of things going on in our society right now that are really important to bring awareness to. Honestly, opening my eyes to things. So I'm loving it for that. It's very interesting. It's very heavy. So I have to be in the mood to watch it. But it, it, it really is incredible. And Zendaya's in it and she's freaking awesome. Next up, Grand Hotel. I talked about this also recently, but I freaking love this show. It is so good. It's about a family that owns a hotel in Miami. And it's kind of like Dynasty, but like Hotel Edition in Miami. I love the show Dynasty. I'm also finishing that right now, season two. Haven't even finished that. Or season three, whatever whatever the last season is on Netflix. I'm watching that right now too. Um, but I love Grand Hotel and it's one of those. It's on Hulu right now. And it's like also live streaming 
anything on TV. So there's like a new episode. I think it's like every Tuesday or every Monday. So I like wait literally every week for the new episode. Like I binge watched the first few and then I was like caught up and I was so sad. And then the last show I'm watching is called All American. I love this show. It's about like high school football and it just brings me back. And there's a lot of deep stuff that goes into it as well. But it's just like a really good show. It's on Netflix. Really, really into that. Oh, and Delaney and I just finished watching Dead to Me. It was pretty good. It was kind of weird at times, but it was like funny, but good. And like the ending, I'm like, whoa. It's interesting. It's a Netflix original show, I believe, so. My lighting is just not it today. I'm sorry, fam. As for music, check out my back to school playlist on Spotify. That's the music I'm listening to right now. It's a lot of the music that I did or listened to in my drive with me like a little bit ago, so I'm loving that. And then I'm also loving Delaney's Coffee House playlist. She has a couple playlists on her Spotify. I think her Spotify is just Delaney free, but her Coffee House playlist in particular has been great. When I wake up in the morning, I just tell Alexa to play it, and it's just, it's so good. It's just got like, kind of like more indie pop songs, like songs you would hear in a coffee shop, honestly. Um, and it's really, really good. She also has a jazzy playlist I love. Um, yeah, and I heard Post Malone's releasing new music soon. I'm very excited because I'm seeing him in concert in October. Can't wait. We did it! We're done! I love filming videos. It puts me in the best mood. Like, I'm in such a good mood right now. I actually have a class tonight at 4.40. It's really, really random. It's like a two hour class for like professional development. It's like a good class, but I'm like, I have to get back in class mode now, but I just like wanted to film this video. Make sure to check out Thread Up. You can click the link down below for 30% off your first order. I'm obsessed with this stuff. I got, um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so much. Let me know if you like this video, if you like this filming setup. I like it, so I'm probably gonna film it again. Hope we're cool with that. And yeah, I'll have a link down below to everything I talked about, and I'll see you guys very soon for my next video. Bye-bye!